Welcome back to the Steve Spurrier Show. Congratulations to our Corner Pantry Game Ball Giveaway winner. And now it's time for our feature. We've got uh, junior fullback with us, and that's Patrick DeMarco, of course a Florida native who's come up here to the University of South Carolina to play fullback and hybrid uh, tight end, everything else. They call it, what do they call you actually, Patrick, most of the time? H-back, which is, I mean, it's kind of a variation of what the tight end and a fullback does. Kind of both things, catches the ball, runs the ball, does a lot of blocking, so fits me pretty well. well we're watching a little bit of film with uh, Patrick. This is what uh, you guys do in preparation for every game, is that right? Definitely. A lot of that? Yes, sir. Generally, when you put a reel on and you're watching uh, NC State or Georgia, what are some of the first things that you're looking for? Uh, just the, the physicality of the linebackers usually and uh, how they pursue blocks, how which short they're taking on with, what kind of tacklers they are. There's, I mean, a lot of things. Usually we watch more blitz, their blitzes and stuff because, I mean, with uh, just the schematics of their defense, a lot of it is around their blitzes and how they're going to pressure our quarterback. So, Does that change a lot from week to week? Yeah, definitely. They're a, this, Georgia was a, was a, not really a big blitz team, but NC State blitzed a lot. So, I mean, it varies from week to week depending on the type of defense that they have. How do you keep yourself motivated to go in and block for those glamour backs like uh, Brian Maddox and Jarvis Giles all the time? Well, I mean, I block for them just so whenever I get the ball, maybe they'll block for me. <laughs> That's a good point. Kind, of, kind of thinking of it like that, but uh, I mean, it's it's a bruising job going in there and sticking heads with people every other play. But uh, I mean, if a, a, they have a big run, if I have a big run, either way, it's the same difference. I do my job, they do, de do to their job, so. Now be brutally honest with us. Did they give you the love in the film room when they see a good block like oh, that? Oh, yeah, Coach Spurrier singles it out. Good block, D-Mark, so. I mean, I get a little love. If you had a young fullback or young football player who wanted to play at this level, what do you think the, the top two, three are things that you would tell them about what it takes to play fullback at a, at a major college in the Southeastern Conference? You have to be a tough-nosed kid. You have to not care about getting your uh, head around a couple times. You have to work hard because day in and day out you're hitting linebackers that are your size, if not bigger than you. It's, uh, it's a lot of work, a lot of work that gets uh, over, overseen by a lot of people just because Fullback's just supposed to be a tough guy. Patrick DeMarco has been with us today on the Steve Spurrier Show, a guy who goes unnoticed to everyone except his teammates and, of course, the coaches that follow him as well and everybody here on the Steve Spurrier Show. We appreciate you being with us. Good luck the rest of the way. We'll be lobbying for you to get some more carries. Thanks for having me.